Well, I work in um, quite an exciting area at the moment. I work in electromagnetic materials, and what we're interested in are the ways that um, electromagnetic radiation interacts with the materials that we have around us. So I'm interested in ways that we can, um, the ways that we can change that interaction by texturing materials or by adding some kind of uh, additional structure to the, the natural materials that exist around us every day. Um, a particular area of interest is uh, the idea we have, uh, which we develop with other universities, um, which is called uh, spatial transformations. And what it allows us to do is to really warp electromagnetic space so that light or microwaves or terahertz actually moves in a different uh, direction to what it would, it would naturally take. Um, and we're interested in taking all those ideas and building in the concepts of um, invisibility and cloaking that have, of course, been over in the literature and, and in the public media over the last couple of years. The applications of this kind of research, well, they, 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 they range from things like building small antennas, for example, in mobile phones, to things like building um, um, d devices which enable you to transmit electricity wirelessly. Um, and to obviously there's, there's uh, defense implications as well of being able to hide objects from, from radar, for example. And, and the, just the idea of making things invisible to, to Wi-Fi technology, to, the, to wireless communications. We can actually cloak out objects, which we, we, which, or we can cloak out entire rooms or shield entire rooms from um, Wi-Fi signals that uh, we might not want to penetrate within certain boundaries.